I am starting this vlog really late in the day. It is almost 7 o'clock p.m. It's been a long day. Been over in my father's house. And seeing his memory and his life pretty much just not like it used to be. It kind of gets you down when you see your loved ones get in that situation. But we all know that's part of life. Went over to his house because his air conditioned fan, indoor fan, would not turn off. Don't matter if you put it in air condition or you put it in heat, take the fan to put it on, on or auto or turn the whole thing off and don't put it in heat or cool. The indoor fan just kept running. And sometimes the outdoor unit came on as well, even though it was not on heat and it was not on cool, the outdoor unit still wanted to come on. So we fixed that problem. And it was just a bad wire that was shorting out and sending power where normally the thermostat was send the power, even though the thermostat wasn't send the power, it would send it there anyway, so it made things come on that did not supposed to come on. And there is no video of that on the heat and air channel. I did not record any of it. I pretty much went over there just to get that fixed and spend time with him and get things done. I had to put up his bathroom light. He took it down months ago and had in all intentions to clean the, the, the glass globe on it and put it back up and all. But he didn't remember where he put the light and the globe, so he never put it back up. My brother's over there and his wife is over there spending some time with him. To be sure everything's getting taken care of, be sure all of his bills are getting paid on time and stuff, which in the past we can see that sometimes he skips a bill and it don't get paid just because his memory is just not what it used to be. So we have to make more time to be there for him and be sure he's getting taken care of because it's getting to the point where he's not able to take care of himself as he once was. Which is sad, but we, you know, we knew someday it will come to that because that's just part of life. So I guess Today's vlog is basically, as the title says it is, spend as much time with your loved ones as you can. Because you never know when your loved ones will no longer be here. Just like my daddy has mentioned many times about the ones he uh, grew up with in the church and stuff like that, that they have all passed away and basically he's the only one left. Um, so always spend time with your loved ones, your family and all. Every chance you get 
before you know it. They're going to be gone. And you will regret for not spending that quality time with your loved ones. You can't bring them back. You can't make up for the time that you missed. Well, I want to go out of town or whatever and on vacation instead of going over to your family. Especially the older ones. The ones that, you know, it's not going to be here as long. You know, that's just the facts of life that, you know, we're not here forever. So you have to spend that quality time together. And that's one of the main reasons why I live where I live now. I am, if you took a drive from my house straight to my father's house, a straight line from point A to point B, the shortest distance. If there was a road that goes from my house straight to his house, I would say it's probably maybe a mile, maybe. But going around the roads that we have to to get there is probably equal up to about two miles. But I try to go over there every day. Yeah, as I was saying, you have to spend that quality time while you have it. Because it can be taken away at any second. Just like these famous people this year, especially beginning of 2016, I mean, they were one after another just being, just passing away. And now we just had one um, pass away, I do believe, some character in Star Wars, I do believe it is. I mean, some characters that I was watching on TV when I was in my teens or early 20s that is dead and gone now it's just that's why I spend every second that I can with my family my wife my kids my brothers and sister my dad I mean every second I can get but I and blessed to be in the shape that I'm in now to still be able to do the work as I used to crawl in the attics underneath homes they say when you get older you start feeling get more tired and all sooner in a day you want to start going to bed like nine ten o'clock because you're just so tired quicker but so far i don't i don't feel that way as you can tell in these vlogs i'm going to bed you know one two o'clock in the morning because i'm there you know vlogging that early in the morning and i'll get to bed two three and i'll get up seven o'clock and go all day again, back to back. But I guess doing this ever since 1988, which is what, 28 years I do believe. I think that's what it comes out to be. Yeah, 28 years. So next year in June, I do believe we'll make it or actually before June, somewhere around April or May of 2017 would make me be in the heating and air industry for 29 years. 29 years. But just like life, as it really is, eventually, it's going to get to the point where I'm not able to do that anymore. 
I don't see me not able to do that anytime soon. I will be 51 years old in 2017, but I don't feel it. I can stay up all night, two or three nights in a row like I used to. The doctor says I'm in great health, great heart, not high blood pressure, no um, problems with like diabetic or anything like that, which I have to keep an eye on stuff like that as you get older. Plus my mama got it in her later years and I do believe that's what took her out because after she got diagnosed with diabetes, her life kind of health kind of went down. So something we have to look for and be sure catch it early. That is if it ever does show up. But that is life. So the vlog today is live your life abundantly. Spend it with loved ones. I guess in this vlog, I'm pretty much trying to get a point across of saying spend time every second that you can get with your brothers and sisters, your mama, your father, your kids, whatever it may be. Spend every second that you can with them while you still can. Because if you don't, you most likely going to regret it when something happens that you don't have that opportunity anymore. So I'm going to pretty much end the vlog there. I know it's, it wasn't showing much of what I did today, but it's pretty much I was at my father's house fixing his air conditioning. Talking to my brother, be sure we work together, that our father is, our father is being taken care of and be sure his bills and everything else is getting paid on time. So it's not the best part of the life, but it is part of life. And there's no way around it. It's our responsibility to take care of our mother and father when they get older because they took care of us and raised us. And even if they did not raise us for one reason or another, and you have the opportunity to spend time with them and look over them and help them in them in their older years it's something that you would cherish forever so like always do something today that would take you to that next level until next time spend time with your family in all reality that's all you got really because nothing else matters <laughs>